Peter? Uh, up count swing level one, eight count one. So we did, let's see, okay, well, we did this. We did this is start. We did the rock step boom. So we did rock step boom, rock step boom. Quick, quick, slow, quick, quick, slow. Then we practice the scoots or the triple steps or the gallops, whatever you want to call them. They're called triple steps, so don't freak out. Then we did. Oh, we went the other way. So now we just take that little feeling and replace the boom. So if we had rock, step, boom, and a rock, step, boom, now we change it to rock, step, boop, bigger, rock, step, boop, bigger, rock, step, boop, bigger, rock, step, boop, bigger. We tried that same idea in closed position. So we did this. I put my hand over my collar back like this. She puts her over the top. We just rest it. I'm resting mine on her. She's not grabbing my shoulder. Then we go forward and back, same idea, but now I'm going to start running and dance. She will almost always start right. So when we do this, the same rhythm applies. Rock, step, boom. Rock, step, boom. Rock, step, boom. Rock, step, boom. Once again, we change the booms to those triple steps with just a little scoop, nothing too fancy. Rock, step, scoop, and a rock, step, scoop. I let the momentum take me forward, and the rock step catches me and turns me around. Remember, take two steps. Take two steps. You gotta pick your feet up and go for it. Burn some calories. It makes a big difference to your success. A little bounce on your belly button the whole time really will help. So that's a little nothing step. From there we did the flip flop. The flip flop is a lot like the practice that we did in the circle holding hands. It goes like this. Uh, 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 uh. I actually have to leave my follower. I close my hands and my belly. I just kick this thing off and I let it open up on the other side. The followers should keep active and sort of follow through. If you're going this way, keep going that way. And if I set you rotating one way, keep rotating that way. That's what Sage is doing, and it fills up the space really nicely. We did uh, that, and then one more thing. Uh, I just take my follower and I put her in front of me. Boop, we just did that. Boom, I put her back. And so we're doing that because uh, we've got to practice just not thinking too hard and pushing the point. I take both hands, I leave a station side space between them, I put them in front of me. One little point we talked about is when I put my hands in front, if I'm reaching around too far, it can be uncomfortable. So then I just give a little more space, and then it's all good. Oh, you can do the same thing, you can grab the shoulder, and that's really weird. And that doesn't work as good, so you can just let these things relax with a little slide and slide. And my arm's size two, maybe down on his arm, and that's okay. Cool, so when we do that, we do that with the steps. Triple step, rock, step, triple step. Rock, step, triple step. Rock, step, triple step. That's all we did. You guys just try it out, we'll rock it out next time in two weeks. Do 